Hello, this is Sun from Isense USA. This video is about how to run control solution testing with Kerasense and Voice. Uh, first of all, you would need your meter, and the test strip vial, and of course, control solution. Uh, please ensure that the expiry on both control solution as well as test strip is valid. Uh, please keep in mind that once you open this Kerasense control solution uh, to use, from the date of opening, it will expire in three months. So first of all, uh, most important part is this range here. You will see control A, 111 to 151 milligram per deciliter. So the control solution testing result that is shown upon our testing in this video should be within that range. So first of all, take out a test strip and insert the test strip into the meter like so. And now from there, you're going to press and hold the up arrow button for three seconds to mark as control solution testing. Control solution test. And like Please so. apply a control solution onto the test strip. Now trip. from here, I want you to shake the control solution vial for at least five, up to five seconds or so. Then what you're going to do is open the cap. Uh, maybe throw away a couple drops onto a tissue. And then you're going to squeeze the control solution onto the top of the cap and lift the whole thing to dip into the control solution. Your control solution test result is 128 milligram per deciliter. Now you can see that 128 is shown, which is between 111 to 151. So it means that the meter and the test strip is working properly. From here, it's as simple as taking out the test strip to discard it, and it is good to go.